Hello, hello, my Mexico lovers. This is your real estate guide again. The Mexican with a plan. Today, we are shooting from, look at this beauty. The famous Stone Island of Mazatlán, which is actually not an island, but a peninsula. But people like it island, uh, island and it works for us. This is a real Mexican beach where mainly the locals and the national tourists come to enjoy themselves the tranquility. This is the end of April 2023 and we decided to come and chill out just after the big wave of tourists just left Mazatlán. And yeah, because last week then we have the motorcycle week and this was for the previous one we have the holy week which is similar to easter in the u.s so you can imagine how many people were here it was insane so this is a very nice place to, to be with a lot of activities you can do the horse ride you can go in a wagon too they can rent you kayaks as you can see there bananas uh, you can get a trip in a boat many things to enjoy the best thing is that the food is mainly cooked at the moment uh, and is local maybe you can see in the back a long street of uh, a stream of coconut trees they, they have been there for about 40 years plus one governor decided to give an impulse to the coconut oil back then but then, you know, when the next government came in, the state governor, they abandoned that and, and the palm trees are still there. Good thing is that the locals are taking advantage of it and you can find a coconut to enjoy pretty much all over here and in Mazatlán. They are very abundant. So, the purpose of this video is to tell you a little bit, give you about Mexico real estate and give you five main reasons to invest in Mexico. <clears throat> there is no need for me to explain you what's going on in our northern neighbor countries. Uh, what I can tell you, and for sure you, you will know too, there is a myriad of people coming here, not only the baby boomers, but a lot of the online workers uh, <clears throat> The internet nomads, they are moving to countries where lifestyle is a little uh, cheaper. And that takes us to the reason number one, lifestyle. You know, the exchange here nowadays is 18, 19 pesos to a dollar. So if you can live with the money, we take you to live very humbly in the US and Canada. You can live almost like a king here have a very nice lifestyle for the cheap especially if you know where to buy it and everything you need rent is very cheap too so it's a very good reason to come down to invest here in mexico okay reason number two equity and this is one of my areas of speciality, you know, equity here in Mexico. Uh, the development going on right now here in Mazatlán is amazing. It's really, really amazing. Everybody is building. Everybody thinks they are realtors. Everybody is doing real estate. Maybe you can see there is a little island over there in the shape of a triangle. That's called the Goat Island. And in the other side is the lighthouse. Maybe you have seen it in, in my previous videos. The highest functioning lighthouse in the world is right there in Mazatlán. It's one of our record Guinness. <clears throat> so next to the Goats Island, you might see a strip of homes all over. That was uh, a federal area recently. Now they are giving one concession after another and they are building homes. More than that, all over Mazatlán, they are building a little more right now as we speak a little more than a hundred towers 
a hundred developments and many of those are in front of the beach so you can imagine the availability of condos we have uh, in the boardwalk for example we have the longest beachfront boardwalk of latin america in the boardwalk we have one one building that has two towers and is three floors high i don't know how they got the permit the permit but they did so there is a a lot of inventory and the equity is growing every day prices are growing ridiculously but there is still a lot of room for a great investment here why because there are there is still a lot of offer coming on and a lot of demand too so eventually when i i think it won't take too long for we to get to the equilibrium point and the construction stops a little bit then the prices will start like uh, going up like crazy you know uh, my business partner who is a usa citizen he feels like Mazatlan right now is like uh, la in the 60s you know so you can have an idea of what this is becoming but right now is a great time to take your dollars out of the u.s and come and invest in here and i don't need to tell you what's going on in these places and what might happen to the dollar in the future i'm not a financial expert but might be a good idea to consider to come and invest in real estate here before it keeps devaluating the way it's doing right now so up to you guys so coming back to the topic we have the lifestyle the equity we also have the healthcare factor <coughs> and you may include that into the lifestyle you can also separate it as a different factor <coughs> you know uh, healthcare here is about a tenth of the price that is in the u.s actually maybe you have seen my video of tijuana if not i invite you to, to to go and look at it a lot of people go over the border from san diego and the surrounding areas to tijuana used to get cheap uh, health care and health services and some many vacationers come to mazatlan and they do that too because it's really really cheaper compared to the u.s really really cheaper but of course you don't have to expect like many foreigners do to have everything for free of course you have to pay and you have to get to know the market and appreciate how lucky you are by being here like we do so that's number three all right number four the weather right now we are in the 70s fahrenheit degrees i would guess like 25 to 28 celsius this weather is delicious look at people around enjoy it enjoying the place it's a little forecast delicious here in mazatlan for example we are close to the to the capricorn tropic you see if you divide the globe in four areas in the middle you have the equator and then in the in the first in the middle of the equator and the north pole we have the capricorn <coughs> the capricorn tropic okay that means one of the best weathers in the world we have the same weather in cabo because it's close to the same line and in hawaii but of course Cabo is that twice the price of Mazatlan and Hawaii is like four times more expensive than Mazatlan so there is a no-brainer guys this is the best place to be because of the weather the variety of food is a lot better too we have a lot more variety all over Mexico and also if you dislike this we have nine ecosystems all throughout Mexico okay and we have a lot of history too 
Mazatlán, for example, is the only beach destination in Mexico. If you have seen my videos, my other videos, you know this. Mazatlán is the only beach destination in Mexico with an historic center. But like that, we have plenty all over Mexico. Actually, last time I counted, we were we had in Mexico like 122 magic towns. If you don't know what is that, uh, go and search for it on the net. There are some requirements for some people, mainly historic, to be qualified as magic towns. And we have like three or four in Sinaloa and many all over Mexico. So that's a big adventure to get to know them all. <clears throat> and finally, what I would include in number five could be the culture. You know, the cultural richness of Mexico is something that I've never seen in other countries. And I visit a few, but this is amazing, you know. The language is different from here to Mazatlán to Culiacán, the capital of the state, which is like two hours distance. So, and all over Mexico, we have many different cultures. The variety of food is amazing. We have two states that have been named intangible patrimony of humanity because of the, the gastronomy. One of those is Oaxaca and the other one is Veracruz. You need to go and try everything over there. Of course, you gotta train your stomach a little bit because most of the foreigners are very susceptible to fragile, to bacteria and virus and all that. You need to get your immune system a little stronger and be able to try many things. So, if you are thinking about leaving the US or Canada because all the, you have to suffer with high prices, politics, weather, horrible weather, Mexico, no doubt about it, is the best choice. Other than that is the proximity. You are pretty close. Four to six hour flight, you'll be, you'll be here in Mexico enjoying yourself. So, now, sorry about that, technical problems. As you know, this is as simple as living in Mexico. Use one take and keep it simple. Just like we want to, you to live here. So here you go, friends, five of the many reasons to invest or relocate to Mexico. Hope you guys enjoy this video and any question, feel free to contact us. Hasta la vista, amigos.